Elon Musk announced that a brain implant created by his health tech firm is expected to start human testing within six months. During a recent presentation by Neuralink, Musk provided updates on the company's wireless brain chip while revealing his plans of implanting the chip in his own brain. He also discussed the prospects of conducting clinical trials. Musk reportedly stated that utmost caution and certainty is necessary to ensure the successful functioning of a device before it is implanted in a human. Neuralink has announced that it is working on brain chip interfaces that have the potential to restore vision for the blind and full body functionality, such as movement and verbal communication for individuals who have incurred spinal cord injuries. According to news websites, the technology aims to achieve a remarkable feat, using electrical signals to communicate with the brain, thereby enabling it to interpret information from sensors and translate them into movements or signals recognizable by the user. The company announced that the interface designed for the motor cortex can undergo human testing in as early as six months. Musk mentioned that the company has submitted most of the required FDA paperwork to allow the implant of the device into a human body. Neuralink has been conducting experiments on animals while it awaits the go-ahead for clinical trials. The goal of this technology is to create a direct interface between the human brain and computers, which could have a wide range of applications, from restoring mobility to people with paralysis to improving memory and cognitive function. The idea of implanting a microchip in the brain is not new, and there have been several research projects over the years exploring this concept. However, what sets Neuralink apart is the company's focus on developing a high-bandwidth, wireless interface that can transmit large amounts of data between the brain and computer in real time. The technology works by implanting small, flexible threads into the brain, which are then connected to a small device called the Link. The Link is a small computer that is implanted behind the ear and is designed to communicate wirelessly with external devices, such as smartphones or computers. The threads that are implanted in the brain are thinner than a human hair and are designed to minimize damage to the brain tissue. The threads are also flexible, which allows them to move with the brain and minimize the risk of damage or rejection. One of the primary applications of this technology is to restore mobility to people with paralysis. By implanting the microchip in the brain and connecting it to a computer or robotic device, it may be possible to bypass the damaged spinal cord and restore movement to paralyzed limbs. Another potential application is to improve memory and cognitive function. By implanting the microchip in the brain and using it to stimulate certain areas, it may be possible to enhance memory and cognitive function in people with brain injuries or neurological disorders. While the potential applications of this technology are exciting, there are also significant ethical and practical considerations that need to be addressed. One concern is the risk of infection or damage to the brain tissue during the implantation process. This is a complex and delicate procedure that requires a high level of skill and precision, and there is a risk of complications or adverse effects. Another concern is the potential for the technology to be used for nefarious purposes, such as mind control or surveillance. While the technology is currently being developed for medical and therapeutic purposes, there is always a risk that it could be used for other purposes in the future. There are also concerns about privacy and security. With a direct interface between the brain and computer, there is a risk that sensitive personal information could be accessed or stolen. There is also the risk that the technology could be hacked or manipulated for malicious purposes. Despite these concerns, there is significant potential for this technology to revolutionize the way we interact with computers and machines. By creating a direct interface between the brain and computer, it may be possible to create a more seamless and intuitive way of interacting with technology. It is also worth noting that the development of this technology is still in the early stages, and there is much work that needs to be done before it can be widely adopted. The technology needs to be tested and refined to ensure its safety and effectiveness, and there are still many unanswered questions about how it will work in practice. As of right now, Elon Musk's company, Neuralink, is working on developing a microchip that can be implanted in the human brain. While the technology is still in the early stages of development, it has the potential to revolutionize the way we interact with computers and machines. However, there are also significant ethical and practical considerations that need to be addressed 
including concerns about safety, privacy, and the potential for misuse. As the technology continues to evolve, it is important that we carefully consider these issues and work to ensure that it is used for the benefit of humanity. Elon Musk says scientists only have a 5-10% to chance of being able to make AI safe. Although many people have put a lot of hope in the future of artificial intelligence and in the possibilities that can emerge from a world run with the help of cognizant machines, one tech mogul is not so hopeful. Elon Musk is highly involved in the creation of artificial intelligence, as well as research into the development of, of brain-computer interface technology that would allow humans to essentially merge with machines. His company, OpenAI, has even created an artificial intelligence system capable of self-teaching. Yet, despite his heavy involvement in the field, Musk remains apprehensive about a future run by machines and estimates that the ongoing efforts to make artificial intelligence safe for humans only has a 5-10% to chance of success. This dire prediction means that AI will almost certainly pose an immense risk to humankind, and Musk is not the only one to recognize and voice these concerns. Stephen Hawking repeatedly claimed that he was certain that artificial intelligence systems are distinctly dangerous and could potentially replace humans altogether. Yet the realm of artificial intelligence development moves resolutely forward, and with it the capabilities of non-humans. AI systems have been developed that create languages, express curiosity, diagnose illnesses, identify different or unusual behaviors, perform military simulations, and even systems that are capable of creating other AI systems. It would seem that, with only a small amount of further development, the machines would not need us anymore. However, Musk is less concerned with a robot uprising, reminiscent of a scene from a movie, and more concerned with the potential barriers and possibilities that he sees in a future run by artificial intelligence. Firstly, he is wary of the potential for a system to be created that is not only smarter than humans, but also has the capacity for independent learning with no limits. Even though algorithms can be programmed or trained to recognize good and bad actions, they lack the emotional aspect of human feelings. When this unlimited knowledge is combined with the fact that AI machines lack emotions, remorse, or an inherent moral code, the possibilities for what an artificial system is capable of is alarming. Musk is also concerned about the likelihood that this enormous power would be controlled by just a few companies with the funds to develop the technology and there is currently no oversight or regulations that would check the almost limitless power of whoever controlled the realm of artificial intelligence. It remains to be seen whether Musk's predictions will come to fruition, but in the meantime researchers are carefully navigating this never-before-entered realm of non-human intelligence. During the SpaceX Falcon 9 mission, an unexpected visitor made an appearance on the rocket's live video feed. As the rocket was approaching the International Space Station, viewers noticed a small mouse-like creature clinging to the outside of the spacecraft. The appearance of the mouse sparked a flurry of activity on social media, with many people speculating about how the creature could have possibly made it onto the rocket in the first place. Some suggested that it may have been a stowaway, accidentally trapped inside the spacecraft during its construction or preparation. Interestingly, this isn't the first time that animals have allegedly been seen in space, with astronauts saying that they noticed what appears to be living creatures outside the International Space Station. However, it soon became clear that the mouse was not a real creature at all, but rather a piece of debris or a visual anomaly. NASA quickly issued a statement confirming that there were no live animals on board the spacecraft and that the mouse was likely a reflection or shadow. Despite the debunking of the mouse sighting, it raised important questions about the risks of space debris and the need for increased vigilance in monitoring potential hazards in space. Even small pieces of debris or objects that may seem harmless can pose a significant threat to spacecraft and astronauts in orbit, and it is essential that steps are taken to minimize the risks of collisions or other accidents. In recent years, there have been several incidents of space debris posing a serious threat to spacecraft and the International Space Station. In 2018, for example, a tiny hole was discovered in the International Space Station, which was believed to have been caused by a piece of space debris or micrometeoroid. 
The hole caused a drop in air pressure inside the station and had to be quickly patched up to prevent further damage. The incident highlighted the need for improved monitoring of space debris, as well as the importance of developing new technologies and strategies to protect against potential hazards. In response, NASA has launched a number of initiatives aimed at tracking and mitigating space debris, including the development of new sensors and technologies to detect and avoid potential collisions. As of right now, the mouse sighting during the SpaceX Falcon 9 mission serves as a reminder of the complex and often unpredictable nature of space travel and the need for constant vigilance and attention to detail. While the incident may have turned out to be a harmless visual anomaly, it underscores the importance of careful planning and preparation in every aspect of space exploration, from the design and construction of spacecraft to the monitoring of potential hazards in orbit. This hasn't stopped people from finding strange anomalies in photographs taken by NASA, which they use as proof that something strange is going on. According to a recent social media post, online users have said that they've spotted something strange during this NASA mission. NASA's Lunar Reconnaissance Orbiter camera captured images that led to the discovery of what appeared to be a large pyramid. The theorist who found the image put forth the idea that in the past, there may have been an empire that lived in proximity to Earth. Moreover, the theorist indicated that the pyramid visible on the surface of the Moon serves as evidence of this presence. Oddly enough, over the last few years, a variety of interesting discoveries have been made in old NASA images, leading those who investigate the unknown to say that these anomalies need to be studied further. According to one post, a pyramid has been discovered on the Moon, measuring approximately one kilometer across and resembling pyramids found in Egypt. The source of the information is a NASA-supported website that is utilized by researchers. According to one user, it is possible that advanced beings migrated from the Moon to Earth several millennia ago. In order to support this theory, the user shared these mysterious photographs, and those who saw the images are convinced that the Moon was once inhabited by an advanced civilization. However, NASA have clarified these findings and have said that they're not impressed. NASA presents a contrasting narrative and points out that the arrangement sighted on the Moon's surface is entirely natural, and there is no indication of it being artificial. NASA has identified that moderately viscous materials can behave in unexpected ways, though full comprehension would require a more intimate understanding of melt pond dynamics in still molten deposits. Based on the occurrence of isolated domes forming in a local source directly beneath them, it suggests molten behavior. This phenomenon is happening in impact melt, which makes it inappropriate to label it volcanic. So, as of right now, although these formations look like pyramids, NASA has labeled them as being natural. SpaceX, founded by Elon Musk in 2002, is a private aerospace company that has been at the forefront of space exploration and innovation in recent years. One of the company's most ambitious goals is to establish a human settlement on Mars, and it has been actively working towards this objective through a series of missions and initiatives. The Mars mission is part of SpaceX's broader vision to make life multi-planetary and to provide a backup for humanity in case of catastrophic events on Earth. The company's goal is to develop the technology and infrastructure necessary to establish a self-sustaining civilization on Mars with the ultimate aim of colonizing the planet. To achieve this goal, SpaceX has been working on a number of initiatives, including the development of the Starship spacecraft and the Super Heavy rocket, which will be used to transport people and cargo to Mars. The Starship spacecraft is designed to be fully reusable, with the ability to carry up to 100 people and a variety of equipment and supplies. In addition to the development of the spacecraft and rocket, SpaceX has also been working on the establishment of the necessary infrastructure on Mars. This includes plans to develop a propellant plant on the planet, which will be used to produce fuel for the return journey to Earth. The Mars mission has been a major focus for SpaceX in recent years, with the company conducting several test flights of the Starship spacecraft and the Super Heavy rocket. The company has also been working closely with NASA and other space agencies to develop partnerships and collaborations that will support the mission. Despite the significant progress made by SpaceX, there are still many challenges and obstacles that must be overcome in order to establish a human settlement on Mars. One of the biggest challenges is the harsh and unforgiving environment of the planet, 
which presents numerous risks and hazards to human life. To address these challenges, SpaceX is working on a variety of technologies and strategies to ensure the safety and well-being of its astronauts on Mars. This includes the development of advanced life support systems, as well as the use of 3D printing technology to create essential equipment and infrastructure on the planet. In addition to the challenges of establishing a human settlement on Mars, there are also significant logistical and financial challenges associated with the mission. Developing the necessary technology and infrastructure and transporting people and supplies to Mars will require enormous amounts of resources and funding. Despite these challenges, SpaceX remains committed to its Mars mission and is actively working to overcome the obstacles in its path. The company has a history of pushing the boundaries of what is possible in space exploration and its innovative approach and determination suggest that it may be well positioned to achieve its goal of establishing a human settlement on Mars. The Mars mission is not just a lofty goal for SpaceX, but an important step forward for humanity as a whole. The establishment of a self-sustaining civilization on Mars would represent a major achievement for our species and could open up new possibilities for scientific research and exploration. In addition, the mission could provide a valuable backup plan for humanity, ensuring that we have a secure and sustainable future even in the face of potential global catastrophes. The establishment of a human settlement on Mars would represent a major step towards achieving this goal and could have far-reaching implications for the future of our species. As of right now, SpaceX's Mars mission is an ambitious and visionary project that has the potential to change the course of human history. While there are still many challenges and obstacles to overcome, the company's innovative approach and dedication to the mission suggest that it may be well positioned to achieve its goals. If successful, the mission could represent a major milestone in human achievement and could pave the way for new discoveries and possibilities in space exploration. But what do you make of these recent discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.